Kids, listen to that one. Yeah, maybe not just stay away from them all together yeah. right now because the conditions are just so rough out there. Any little spark to get a fire going, and it would be very difficult to get right. out. And we're already seeing the firefighters struggle out there. What's going on right now? So let's go ahead and talk about the weather now. 88 degrees here in Albuquerque, and uh, winds today gusting up to 26 miles an hour as of this hour, sustained out of the west at about 17. And look how low uh, the moisture is. Relative humidity down to 3 percent. It is extremely dry across the state. That is really not going to change anytime soon. We'll see a little more moisture moving in starting tomorrow across eastern New. Mexico, and that could push into the central part of the state. Gives a little bit of, of that boost in moisture, but otherwise, things are really staying pretty dry for us, and we're not going to see much in the way of shower activity either. Red flag warning is still in effect for today uh, down across southeastern New Mexico. That goes until 10 o'clock tonight, where we have breezier conditions, of course, the dry conditions as well, and of of course, the heat. It is extremely hot down in the southeast, upper 90s and triple digits, hot for this time of the year. We're in the low to mid 90s for Clovis and Tucumcari, Albuquerque in the upper 80s, and up to the north, temperatures there in the low 80s. So it is very warm around the entire state. And we're going to see the warmer weather stick around, although eastern New Mexico will get a break from some of the heat for tomorrow as the front pushes our way. And again, you'll get a little boost in moisture. Right now, relative humidity, uh, this is a look at the number, single digits everywhere, down by Silver City. We're at 5%. So uh, the fires over, that are burning over in the Gila there are uh, not looking good as far as how dry it is. And again, it's going to stay pretty dry here for the next several days. Skies mainly clear from New Mexico all the way back to California. Uh, this is where the storm track is, well to our north. So even the storm system that we saw get close to us last week, uh, they're staying far away from us. So we're not going to see anything really big time heading our way anytime soon. We do have a one little cold front that's going to push through tomorrow across northeastern New Mexico, and that will bring in more wind across the east. It'll also bring in the cooler conditions across eastern New Mexico, and we may even see a few spot storms across the central mountain chain and across eastern New Mexico, but for the west, it's just uh, not going to do much at all. We'll still deal with the warm and dry conditions there. For tonight, mainly clear skies. It will be another mild one tonight. The winds will hold off through tonight. In fact, the wind that's around right now will continue to die down. Tomorrow, winds will start to pick up as early as tomorrow morning across northeastern New Mexico. Uh, we'll be looking at winds gusting to 35 miles an hour across northeastern, east central parts of the state. We may even see a few spotty light showers around tomorrow morning, tomorrow afternoon. Central mountain chain could see a few spot thunderstorms as well to the southeast. And then the moisture behind that front will be in place as we head towards your Friday. So that could mean a few more spot storms across the eastern New Mexico and up in the higher terrain up in the northern mountains as we head through your Friday. Uh, maybe the western high terrain, if some of that moisture gets through the mountains, we may see a spot storm or two there for your Friday. Still not a lot of moisture to work with, and so any rain that does come down will not be much. We'll see less wind Friday. Temperatures stay on the cool side or cooler as we head through Friday, and then they're just rebounding once again going into the weekend. Here's what it's looking like for southern Colorado. Sunny skies tomorrow, warm, low 80s, a little less wind. We'll be in the low 80s as we head through the weekend with more sunshine through the next week. North and west, no rain in the forecast for you at all. Mostly sunny skies and just very warm temperature-wise. Highs in the upper 80s and low 90s for the next several afternoons. South and west could see a little more smoke tomorrow. Winds will be out of the north, coming more easterly late tomorrow. 10 to 15 mile an hour winds are not as bad. Highs in the mid-80s for Silver City and then low 90s for everyone else. South and east, gusts to 35 miles an hour tomorrow afternoon. May see a stray evening thunderstorm with partly cloudy skies and less heat. Highs only in the upper Upper 80s tomorrow. They were back into the into the upper 90s by Saturday. North and east gusts to 35 miles an hour tomorrow. A few thunderstorms are possible in the afternoon. Highs in the 70s to around 80, so a little cooler for you. Back into the mid 80s this weekend. Northern mountains breezy. A few thunderstorms could pop up late tomorrow afternoon. Temperatures cooler. 79 in Santa Fe. You're back into the mid 80s as we head toward the weekend with a chance for a few spot storms in the mountains both tomorrow and Friday. East mountains gusty. May see a stray storm late in the day. For the metro upper 80s tomorrow afternoon with a few clouds rolling in tomorrow evening. I don't think we'll see any rain at all. And Hopefully. Going into the weekend. Hopefully. <laughs> we can keep our fingers crossed. There is moisture coming in. You never know. Okay. Uh, but I would, I would not count on it. Okay. Thanks, Kristen. We'll be right back.